we're going to show you how to set up phone sign in for your Flutterflow apps. Let me show you my current setup. I have a login page, a phone sign in page, which only has a text field and the submit button, and the SMS code verify page, and then a home page, which right now is just an icon. Required setup to make this work is following the Firebase configuration guide here and uploading your Android and iOS configuration files. Once you've done that, you need to go into Firebase and enable phone sign-in. You can watch this video here to see how that works. You need to select your login page and your home page and you're all set. So when, the first thing we'll do is navigate from our current login page to the phone sign-in page when the user interacts with this text here. So let's add that action. On top, authenticate, we actually want to go navigate to the phone sign-in page. All right, now that we have this set up, if we preview, you'll see that when I hit this row, it actually goes to the phone sign-in page, but it still does nothing because it's not configured yet. All right, so what we need to do here is add an action on the submit button that does the phone sign-in. So I've hit action, type is authentication, phone sign-in. Phone sign-in takes the text field and then the verify SMS code page. So here's going to be the phone number. It expects an international format phone number and you need to select the SMS code verify page. After we've done that, you need to go to the SMS code verify page and also add the verification action. You do that by selecting the submit button here and adding an on top action. Type authentication, phone sign in. The phone number, sorry, we actually want to do verify SMS code and connect it to the field. That's it. And with these easy steps, you have phone sign-in enabled.